extended cell signal to help you. Hello? Yeah, hi. Uh, listen, I need somebody to explain what happened in my room while I was gone. Uh, what's your room number? Well, I'm in. I'm staying at 215, and I've been out for business. I've been out whining and dining customers, and I come into my room right now, and I open the room. It smells like sex in here. Uh, one moment, please. Okay. <laughs> Hurry up. Hello? Yes, hello. Hello, um, yes, I'm sorry, but uh, we don't have that kind of uh, information about what's been going on in your room. Well, that's what I'm saying is I've not, I've not been in my room for the last six hours. I come back to my room, and in some form, my room has been violated. Well, um... Well, I'm sorry, but we, let, we let haven't me explain. entered... Let me, let me, let me just... I, I apologize. I, I, well, I apologize. Let me explain what's going on. I walk into my room. It smells like sex and candy. There's a jar of, of French's yellow mustard on one of the chairs. There's mustard that's been sprayed on the television and, and on, on the pillows. Mm. Um, sir, uh, did you leave your window unlocked or open? Uh, well, the window was cracked because I smoked marijuana in here earlier. Yeah, um, sometimes uh, we advise guests to keep uh, their window closed and locked when they're not in the room. Oh, why is that? Because sometimes um, we get people trying to break in. Oh, really? I, di I didn't see this on Yelp. Um, I mean, I, I checked rare, it's, Yelp. It's I, 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 vigor, uh, I vigorously expected Yelp before I came. They said this was a, a, a very nice place. I didn't know that there was, uh, I, a, I guess I didn't a, know that the, the, the mustard sex bandits were about. No, it's a rare occasion, but I've never heard yeah. of um, someone violating someone else's room. That's, I'm sorry. Okay, well, I just, I, I guess I just don't want to be charged for... Uh, the stains and stuff like that in here. So I need someone to come up and inspect my body and my asshole for mustard, so they can they can approve that I you know that I didn't do it. Um, I'll just put the put it on the remarks, noting that um, uh -huh. any stains yeah. that in your yeah. um, linen and bed, um, they were okay. being charged for it. What 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 about the, what about the cigarette burns? Um, you didn't mention that. Yeah, well, I'm going to make this go the extra mile, so I'm going to burn some shit. But put that in the notes, too. Um, if, okay, I'm sorry, sir. Um, you can call in the morning, and we could... Um... Okay, okay, did you make the notes first? Did you make the notes already, though? I'm looking at your uh, reservation right now. Okay. Just let me know when you make the notes, because I have something I want to say. So what it, what had happened, actually, it was me that made all these things. Uh, I had a prostitute in my room, and I filled the condom full of mustard, and I put it on my penis, and I had sex with her, sexual intercourse. And then the excess mustard squirted out around my balls, and then it leaked onto the pillowcases. And so I just don't want to be charged. Hello? This is not proper customer service leaving me on here. This uh, is dead air sorry, time. One moment, please. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay, please. Come. Sometimes, like, I've tried to find it at Walmart. They have the French's mustard uh, flavored ice cream, but I haven't been able to find it yet. I'm a, uh, I'm a mustard connoisseur. Uh, Dijon mustard is the best, uh, but sometimes you get that deli mustard and it has a little horseradish in it, and it puts a little extra burn on you. 
Hello? Hello, ma'am? I'm sorry, hold on, please. Okay, mammakin. Take your time. Um, so we will be able to read your lock to see if anyone um, had access to your room. But nobody yeah. has nobody was authorized um, to access your room. That's because I brought everybody in. I brought at least six people in through the window. Because I didn't want to be charged extra. I'm saying that we can read your lock to see if um, anybody um, has well, Holy shit. Wait, wait a minute. Did you just see you? No, no. Did you just see you could read my cock? Your lock. Yeah, I'm not hearing any differences. I hear C-O-C-K. That is filthy language coming from a customer service representative. I am offended right now. Hello? Um, yes, hello? Yeah, how can you speak to me like that? Black Lives Matter. Um, I just said that I had a mask on, and so it might have sounded um, like you I had a mouth. You word. had a mouth full of what? I don't. Under, I don't understand. I had you had a, a mouth full of I what? Had a mask on. You had a mustard mask on. Hello, hello, hello. This is a manager. This is so this like, is, like my so, this hello. Is pride, okay, this hello? is Pride Month. I don't understand. I don't understand. Yeah, hello. This is Pride okay, Month. So Why are you talking to me like this? Nobody's talking to you like anything. She said that she had a mask on, like we we're supposed to be wearing, like it's mandated by the by the state that we're supposed to wear a mask. Yeah, and don't be getting hey, don't be getting no, no, with me, bitch. No, can you please can, can you listen, okay? Because you now you're going off okay. my staff for something right. that we did not that we did not do. So therefore, we're telling you that we don't understand what's going on, and that we'll read your lock to make sure that nobody else went to your room other than you, because nobody gave like, any key to your room and nobody had access okay. to your room. Okay, are you? Let me ask you this. Are you the mustard maiden? Are you the mustard maiden that fucked up my room? Are you being disrespectful to the manager here? Do you want, do you want, do you want to be disrespectful? No, I'm being, I'm being that's, disrespectful, that's, no, that's to disrespectful to the moo cow bitch on the phone. Who is the bitch? Who are you calling no. a bitch? You, mustard maiden.